This is how you solve a Rubik's Cube using the beginner's method. So, uh, the first step is to create a white cross. So, um, so this is already actually in, in, the, in the right spot because uh, the white and green edge is in the right spot. Meaning that not only is uh, the, uh, the white sticker here, the, uh, but also uh, the green sticker is also matched up with the green center. So this is actually already in the right spot. So now we'll search for an, an, another edge where we see we have uh, a blue one right here. So the opposite of green is blue. So we know that this needs to go here, which is the opposite of green. So if we just move this over, and then we put this piece in and, and realign everything, this actually makes a bar. Next, uh, we have this white and red piece. And here, if it's on the top layer, you actually want to move it um, down with F. And then you see that uh, this piece right here, uh, this, uh, well, like the red sticker, needs to go to the red center, which is right here. So it needs to go to the back. So, uh, so what you can do is you can U, R, and then realign everything as it was. And then the last uh, piece is right over here. So what you can do is, well, since like this is the only spot left, then you can do a U2, then uh, put it in, and then re re realign everything. And, and then the whole entire cross is done, as well as uh, a row of colors is also matching. Next, what you want to do is you want to make uh, the whole entire white side while also making uh, the first layer. So uh, we find white corners. Over here we see that we have white, red, and green. So let's move it so that it's next to the red and green center. So over here you see that, like, that the white piece is on the right hand side. If that's the case then just do RUR prime again. R you are prime and it is inserted in into the right spot but also uh the red is with the red side and the green is, is with the green side next uh, we have this piece right here and the blue and orange side so this is actually already in the right spot so here, here we have the blue center and here we have the orange center and then if the white sticker is on the left hand side then we do F prime, U prime, F. And it's right here. Next, uh, we have uh, the same case as, as in the first time, where the white sticker needs to go here, green, green, orange, orange. R, U, R prime. And then, um, now, now that you have known, now you notice that the whole entire white side is done along with one layer. However, uh, there's one last case, which I'm going to go over. It's uh, when uh, the piece is on the bottom side. If, if it's on the bottom side, then just do RUR prime to take it out. But if it's on the top side, then um, you want to align it that the orange sticker right here matches the orange side and, and that the blue sticker right here matches the blue side over here. So, if it's on the top, then you just do the, th this algorithm. R, U2, R prime, U prime, R, U, R prime. And now the whole entire first layer is done, as, um, as well as the whole, entire, the whole entire white side. Next, uh, we need to put in edges. So, over here, for example, we have red. This, this actually looks like an orange, but it's a red. Red and blue. So we search for the red and blue piece, which is right here. So we actually want to um, take this out into the top um, side over here. So the way to do that is you just face it, and then you do this algorithm. R prime, U prime, R prime, U prime, R prime, U, R, U, R. And what that algorithm does is it moves, actually no, it swaps these two pieces right here. And then this piece ends up over here. 
So now we have the red and blue side. And now we want to align uh, it like that the red sticker right here is with the red side. And, and, and then the blue sticker needs to go over here. If, if that's the case, then you want to hold it um, like this. And you want to do R prime U prime R prime U prime R prime U R U R, and there it is inserted. Next, um, we can do orange and blue. So we search uh, for the orange and blue piece, which is right here. And then what you want to do uh, is align it again, blue, orange, and then you just want to do the same algorithm, and there it is. Next, we have uh, two more uh, edges that need to go in here. And here we have orange and green. And over here, we also have um, orange and green. But in this case, this piece needs to go here. not, uh, And it's not like the case where this piece needs to go here. This needs to go here. So it's a different case. So if this piece needs to go here and it's already al aligned, then you actually want to uh, flip it to the back. And then you want to do R U R U. R, U prime, R prime, U prime, R prime. There it is. And then the last piece is here. Uh, again, align it. And then this piece needs to go here to the red side. And the whole entire second layer is finished. But, if, if uh, the edge is flipped, but it's in the correct spot, then you just want to take it out. And then solve it again by putting this piece in here. Next step is to solve uh, the top side. So over here, um, well, so using like the beginner's method, there used to be a white cross. I'm saying sorry, a, a yellow cross here on top, but there isn't. But we see that we have two edge pieces here, and then if you want to create a cross, then just put uh, the two edge pieces here on top. And then, uh, well, it, 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 in the top left um, side, and do F U R U prime R prime F prime. However, that solves it somehow. I guess that was just the case. But if it's not the case, uh, like this, and do the algorithm, then we actually get the cross. Um, and then, wait. But if there's a horizontal line, then you, you want to hold it horizontally and do wide F, U, R, U, R prime, U prime, R prime, wide F prime. And then that creates a cross. Then if there are two corners al already solved, then you want to uh, search in the third layer for um, a side where at least one yellow, um, well, where a yellow sticker is over here in this side. So, so not this side, not this side, but this side we have a yellow piece here. And then you want to do R U R prime U R U to R prime. And then here we have one um, corner here. So if you have one corner, then just move this corner over here to the bottom left corner. And then you do the same thing. If, if, if it doesn't work, then just do it again. So put it in the bottom left corner. And then it's solved. But uh, if we have if we have zero corners here, then you actually want to search for a side where there's zero ye yellow pieces in the third layer. So so not uh, this one, not this one, not this one. But here there's zero yellow pieces. So you, so you want to face the side and do the algorithm, and then there's one yellow. Um, piece here, which you, well, so what you want to put in the bottom left side, do, do the algorithm, and it's solved. And if, and if there are th three corners solved, then that means that, well, that there's a flipped corner, so you just want to flip the corner. And then, uh, and then the last step is to solve the third layer. So over here we have headlights, and we're going to put uh, the headlights in the solved um, a position which it all it already is, but if it's not, um, then well then just al align the headlights so the two colors here 
uh, they match with the center. And then you want to uh, flip it to the back. And then you do, uh, uh, and then you want to do the algorithm. And then we notice that we have one side right now that's going to be solved. Oops, that's solved. Oh, which is the red side. And then, um, next you want well. So if you have a solved side, and then three headlights, then hold the solved side in the back. And do that algorithm. Oops, I didn't go over. R U prime R U R U R U prime R prime U prime R two. And then yeah, and then if if you do it and it doesn't work, then just do it again. There you go. However, if you have uh, a case where there are no headlights at all and there are no no solved faces, well then just hold um it. W wherever you want, and then you just uh, do this algorithm. And then, now we've noticed that we have a pair of he headlights here. So, so, so you want to align the headlights. Um, so, they're, so they match the center over here. You want to hold it in the back. And it's solved. However, there is still one last case. It's where... Uh, there are no headlights, but one solved face. If that's the case, then hold the solved case um, so side in the back. And then you do that algorithm. And then we have a solved face, which you're going to align, and three headlights. So, so then you want to uh, hold the so solved face in the back. You want to do the algorithm. If it doesn't work, do it again. Oh yeah, also... If we have all four headlights, but no solved faces, then just hold it anywhere, um, as last time, and then you do the algorithm. And then that will make it so there's one solved face and three headlights, and then you hold the solved face in the back, and you do the algorithm. And the cube sh uh, should be solved, and that's how you solve it. I, ho I hope that you guys enjoyed and please like and comment um, if you want to see more videos. And please just recommend like some videos to me. All right. Anyway, thank you. I hope I, ho I hope that you I hope that you found this helpful. And bye.